Let's take a look at how we can allow an app through our computer in Windows 11. I'll click on the Start Menu button and click on Settings. And I'll go ahead and expand and choose Update and Security. On the left-hand side, I'll go ahead and choose Windows Security. And then Firewall and Network Protection. We're almost done. All i got to do now is click on Allow an App Through the Firewall. And when I get that, we can see it's all grayed out. But that's okay. I can just click on Change Settings. And now I can go ahead and select it. Now, if you don't have the option to change settings and it's still grayed out, that's because you have a third-party application, such as an antivirus program, which is controlling your firewall. So you'll need to go in and make the changes in your third-party application. You won't be able to make those changes here. All right, so now that we've got that done, I'm just going to go ahead and scroll down and choose one of the applications. In this case, I'm going to choose File and Printer Sharing because by default that's not turned on. And when I click that, we can see the public firewall, because that's the active one right now, goes ahead and says, yes, that's enabled. But I'm going to choose to enable it on private and domain as well. And that's because this computer is a member of an Active Directory domain. You may not see that if your computer is not. Now, I can also click on Allow Another App. So if you have an application that just doesn't show up in this list, you can browse to it, such as if it's an executable file. So for instance, if I scroll down or I do a search for star.exe, let's see if I see any executables here. And we can see a whole bunch of them. So I'm just going to go ahead and choose one. Click Open. Click Add. And now I've got that in my list, and I can go ahead and allow that. I don't know what R&R &R installer is, but that's okay. You'll know what application you're trying to choose. Typically, they're going to be in the C program files or program data folders. And so that is how you add a, an application through your firewall in Microsoft Windows 11.